a stroll in the show. Now, our next act is a 12-year-old boy from Swansea. And people are already saying that one day he could be bigger than Tom Jones. Only if he eats his greens. It's Shaheen Jaffa Goli. Well, sometimes I... What do you sing apart from that? <laughs> this is how one song can change your life. It means so much to be here in the final tonight. This whole experience has just been amazing. From being a normal schoolboy to, you know, in the grand final of Rings Got Talent, I can't believe it. When I start singing, my whole body just beams as bright as a light, because singing is something that I love to do so much. This kid, let me tell you, he's really, really talented. I took a really big risk with that huge song in the semi-final, waiting to hear if I'd got through or not. It was so nerve-wracking. Shaheen is definitely a contender, but I think he has to top what he did the other night, and what he did the other night was brilliant. I'm really determined just to go out there tonight, sing my heart out, and prove that I do deserve to be here. This means a lot to me, and I'm not going to let it end here. Here he is, Shaheen Jaffagoli! when I came out and sang on, on the, on the semi-final uh -huh. and I found out that I got through to the final, I just couldn't wait to get back out here and just do it again. Really? It was amazing. You love it. You love it. You love it. You love it. It's, it's been quite a week for you, hasn't it? It has been quite a big week. It's not your average half-term, this one, is it? <laughs> not really. No, no. <laughs> it's been amazing. Let's see uh, what the judges made of it. Piers? Absolutely unbelievable, that. That was incredible. <laughs> so, I was doing some interviews today about what happened to Holly last night and had all these worthy people queuing up to say, you shouldn't have children on this show. It's not fair. It's not fair to the adults when you do that. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, every single round, you have got better and better. And that was, just for your age, an incredible performance. Thank you, Jules. Amanda. It is... It's... Utterly extraordinary. Your voice is so strong, and I can just tell you completely love what you're doing, don't you? Yeah. You have absolute star quality, and it, like Piers said, I can't wait for you to go back to school. It's like, oh, what did you do this half term with your little <laughs> scrapbook, your little autographs from Simon? <laughs> That's it, if you don't. <laughs> it was amazing. Well done. Stronger and stronger every time. Thank you. Thanks, Amanda. Simon? 
I think this, um, you know, this debate about whether we put kids on actually has, has really made me think this week, obviously because of what happened last night. And uh, I, I'm, I, I've been in two minds, whether it's the right thing or the wrong thing. Um, but after that performance, it really made me realise that if you're talented, regardless of your age, you can cope with it, why shouldn't we deny... Why should we deny someone like you the opportunity? Um, because you've coped with this really, really maturely. I think you've had a great time. I think win or lose, it's been a great thing to happen to you. I think you're a super, super talented young man. I think you're a really, really nice guy. I think you've handled yourself brilliantly. And again, I have to say this, you're in with a real shot here, Shahina, winning this whole thing. In with a shot of winning it. It's, I mean, um, due to the audience's point of view, whether I get better and better every round, to me, it gets better every round, uh -huh. you know, just with the compliments and, you know, the support. It's been really great. You've loved it. Stuff. It's been a pleasure having you on as well. You've absolutely loved it. Thank you. Well done, Shaheen. Well done. If you want to see Shaheen performing for the Queen, the number to call is 09011 32 22 Two. But remember, lines don't open till all ten finalists have performed. Ladies and gentlemen, Shaheen! Well done.